So today, we're doing another exciting episode. Chop Throw Kitchen. This has only been on my Snapchat before, and it's normally a grudge match between me and Joey. This time, it's me and Liv. It's being hosted by Zachary, the king of lawn care. All right. The king of lawn care. King of lawn care and king of long hair. He's king of both. So today on Shop Throw Kitchen, if you don't know what that is, because you don't, because we've never done it on YouTube before, it's a cross between cut throw kitchen and chopped. Chopped throw kitchen. Unlimited times, so we only have one stove that we gotta share. Can't be fighting over that shit. Me and Olivia over here got Monopoly cards with $25 million loaded. That's why that's out. Liv, there's your card back. We got 25 million. Zachary Nappy will be hosting. He'll be going ahead. He'll be making the challenges. He'll be doing it all. Yeah, got it all already up He's here. Got it all in his head. He's thinking ahead. It's gonna be great challenges. Be great, great challenges. Not ready. All right. Let's start this up. Kitchen. I'm not trying to brag or anything, but I've won one. You know, I've lost one. I've won one. So like, I'm pretty even here. I gotta win this. I gotta take her out. I know she's my cousin and all, but I got I gotta clean the floor with her, get her on out of here. So uh, Chris, he's, he's a good guy. You know, good cook. I think I think he'll do good. You know, maybe not against me, but um, I think he'll do good. <laughs> Today on Chop Throat Kitchen, Liv and Chris fight the death cooking up. Leftovers. If you wouldn't believe it, leftovers for cooking. <laughs> Got everything in the fridge, everything in the freezer. Who knows what it could be. So he may think, ooh, three chopped throat kitchen. Okay, all right, you know, whatever. But um, I gotta say, there's many a nights where I gotta make myself dinner. And we got a ton of leftovers. And I am very experienced, unlike him who everything's made for him, and that's all I gotta say. She thinks I don't know leftovers? I know leftovers. Leftovers all, I, I'm in college. I've been in college for four years. Think I don't know how to cook with leftovers? That's all I know how to do. What, what you got? This is some chicken breast, potato pancakes. One chicken cutlet. More potato pancakes. Potato salad. Leftover chicken and broccoli. Fried rice. Yum. Mold lettuce. <laughs> Mold lettuce. Hamburger pie. Some sort of pasta. Yeah, some sort of pasta. I think this is spo uh, spoiled, if I remember here. Oh, we got a whole bowl. Mac and cheese. A single piece of bacon. Some pottery salad. So very hard Louisiana lightning chicken salad. You got a couple grapes. Ew, what is this? Oh, I always think it's a rib. <laughs> it's some rib. We got a loose rib. This is burger stuff. <laughs> salad dressing. <laughs> one salad dressing. That's steak. <laughs> That's only from like four days ago. That's good. Four day old steak. <laughs> <laughs> you could kill somebody with that. Tater tots. We got tater tots. We got a half eaten. Uh, it's a full this pork sandwich. This has like mold on it though. Okay. I don't think. Uh, nah, that's not. That's not mold. It's just. Uh, fuzz. That's just fuzz. This. This is not edible. This is not edible. <laughs> this doesn't look too edible. A lot of sauerkraut. Nah, this ain't edible. This ain't edible. <laughs> this is not edible. Two hamburgers and one hot dog. We got onion rings and like some pasta with some Ready lobster to... and red lobster leftovers. Let's start I'm a this challenge. <laughs> Today on Chop Kitchen, we're doing leftovers. We got multiple challenges for opponents that you can't see on screen right now. Um, first challenge that we got going on today is, right over here, we have the just out of reach wobbly table. Chris, demonstrate how out of reach, look at this. Look at this, oh, look, look, look how wobbly that is. Look how, look how he's got a, he's bent over like a, like a savage. You guys, how do you how do you feel about this challenge here? I'm not, I'm not doing this. I'm not doing that. Not doing I'm gonna pay a lot of money. Cut out of here. Cut out of here. 
Players are not. They are not excited about this challenge. Where are you gonna start the bidding at? All right. So the bidding starts Wait, at. How much money do we have? We are, you got twenty-five million dollars. <laughs> All right. Um, we'll start the bidding off at a uh, half a million dollars. We'll see. Uh, uh, we'll see how bad you guys don't want to do this. One million. One million. All right. One, one million. million. Four million. Five. Going five. Five million. Will she do six? Six million. Seven six. million. Seven. Okay. Eight million. Eight million. All right. All right. Nine million. Remember, you only have twenty-five million. Ten. Eleven million. Okay, he really doesn't want to be on that wobbly table. <laughs> Twelve million. Oh my god. Million. Okay, geez. You're out, you're out. That's how you do it. Alright, Chris is uh he can now like all your money. I don't care. <laughs> I don't wanna use that. Show him show him that he's losing money. Oh he's losing that money. His money's going away. He's not gonna there win a go. single cent of that money. I don't need no money. Ain't no need no money. How are you gonna win? And try to win nothing. Okay, so Chris, uh, who yeah, who are you gonna give this wobbly table to? What a, what opponent? <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking this one right here. We're gonna give it to Liv. Okay, Liv's stuck with the the wobbly table prep prep, prep table. Chris is over here on the on the cluttered side. <laughs> Any other challenges? The second challenge is you gotta cook with a glove. Do you guys wanna cook with a glove on? No, no, no. 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 What about you? No, what? I don't care. I'll cook with the glove on. I'll cook with the glove on. Oh my god. He just said he's gonna give it up before we even start the bet. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna start the betting up at um, half a million dollars again. Five million. Dollars. Oh, five. Oh, geez, he is he's already ten million. Oh, that's it. All right, Chris is out because he only has ten million. Love you out of loophole. <laughs> bank it up, bank it up. This glove doesn't even fit. No, yeah, <laughs> that's the best. Children's <laughs> glove. That's the best part about glove. How much? Ten million. Lip still has 15. She's gonna make out good if she wins this one. Thought this glove was gonna be easy. It doesn't even fit. This glove don't even fit. Have to wear a glove that doesn't fit the whole time. This is gonna be rough. Okay, so the rules are there must be at least um, four different things in here. There's gotta be four different um, leftovers. Leftovers. I don't want nothing bland. Uh, you can't just take a hamburger and give me that hamburger. That's what you gotta. You gotta mix it up. You gotta do something to that. I won't be satisfied. Some easy stuff, okay, guys? So, um, go! Chris is tasting, he's got some tasting going on. Walking down the single piece of bacon right now. Thank you. Is this going? Fine, sir. Chris got the bacon. Bacon is going. Okay, we got that over there. This is garbage can. Be respectful, please. Chris has one hand. Doesn't it smell good? I'm not excited. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not eating that. <laughs> it's like two days ago. So it's a chicken from the barbecue for two days ago. Are we allowed to ask some judge questions? Um As long as they have nothing to do with this person. What's the question? Oh, see, no. Oh, the carbs on the table. Live on the wobble <laughs> we'll have one oven, uh, one oven, one oven, one oven only. So we gotta share the oven. Be good sports about it. Chris did take the whole cutting board and he's using that as his workstation, which I do find um, very kind of him. <laughs> no one's at the, not, no one's at the station. Uh, this is perfect time to uh, mess with this person over here. Die Bob. Got an egg, <laughs> and here's for some reason. <laughs> I'm not excited about that. <laughs> what's back? What's back? Back from the bathroom. Back from the bathroom. Can you just drop like a little bit of flour? Look a little bit of flour. Why is she here? I don't know. There you go. Oh, that's good. 
Bright! Did I get my nuts to get away? Yeah, you got sabotaged. You gotta get a, you can get a new one. <laughs> but you just gotta get a new one now. Let's see what she does with the crouton. Nothing. <laughs> She's posting cornbread that already exists. I'm making bread. <laughs> Ow! Oh my god. Have you ever made something go on fire in the oven? <laughs> oh. Yes, many times. It's very hot. <laughs> she says she, she might just leave it there. <laughs> I can't. Oh! Oh. <laughs> Liv, just pick up the. Here, lift it up. Stop! Go under, go underneath. Quick before this glove lights on fire. It's okay. not just like, oh. <laughs> It's kinda of hot in the kitchen. I'm glad no one won for the seafood or the <laughs> Yeah, you gonna die. <laughs> this is a whole this is a whole half gallon of horse rider shoes. Yeah. <laughs> Gloves easy! <laughs> Look at this! Perfect! <laughs> I'm gonna get it in between the fingers, or else it's not gonna work, you know? I'm very excited for the subtle taste of uh, Chris's fingernails. <laughs> <laughs> so close. That is disgusting. That is disgusting. I like how Chris like stared at the thing and he's like, oh yeah, I got it. And then this is what I came up with. Yeah, uh -huh. That's what my brain came up with. <laughs> Need more eggs, apparently. It's not enough salmon salmonella in my in my meal. This is down easy break. <laughs> this is opening a brand new package. <laughs> it's not it's a hole that you can't open it. This is what the challenge was intended to do. <laughs> you didn't even use it this way, you just ate it. <laughs> I'm so disappointed in you, Chris. <laughs> Legit, like, you probably could have put that in that thing, in that concoction, but it tastes so good. <laughs> You're like, no, no, I'll just eat the piece of meat. <laughs> if you at home were ever wondering how to burn butter, uh, this is how you burn butter. You it's just, called uh, browning butter, thank you very much. Um, it's called burning butter. I'm pretty sure this is pretty, that's, that would qualify that as burnt. You just burn it up, you know, it adds a real nice, um, shitty taste to your meal. So this is the, <laughs> this is your bread. And this is your patty, your meat patty. It looks like a veggie patty almost because there's corn in there. It's not. Yes, so. Give you the full details. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, I'm gonna burn the shit out of my hand, dude. <laughs> it's just a hot plate. Oh, God. I wish you could have saw that, people. <laughs> I've never seen someone make the patty on the pan. <laughs> well, when you only got one hand, you can't do much. Ready to plate him. Oh, it's on cheese. I like that. Just topping the patty. I was using this pressure extra time to uh, really schmooze over the judges. She's mixing up a drink. So, uh, explain your meal to that. Thanks. What do you got for me? So, you know, it's so. so right before a kid's soccer game and he's like, ah, oh, ma, I gotta eat so much. You know, gotta carve mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. But you're like, ah, oh, geez, I didn't go stop a shop today. So then, you're like, okay, I'll throw something together. And kids love things in the shape of smiley faces. Okay. So I got some onion ring eyeballs, mm -hmm. and then we got some cornbread with cheese, onion rings, and a chicken cutlet in the middle. We got some mac and cheese garnished with some, um, 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 Tater tots, <laughs> tater tot, and then we got lettuce ears because you know gotta eat the vegetables. But this is a little snack before while they're waiting, you know. Okay. And then um, we got some cherry Coca Cola and <laughs> fruit punch. And then for dessert, you know, gotta gotta give them. Or even for you too, if you're just like waiting, you know, or it's cold at the soccer game, we got some hot chocolate in it. We have a whole chocolate bar in there with a marshmallow and a biscotti. Okay, so there's a lot of there's a lot of um, practice this meal. Let's start off with this uh, fruit nut mix. Well, not bad. They're kind of. I want to say complement each other, but like they don't. You like the sweet and the, salty? The sweet and salty definitely goes. I'm gonna try this drink because that was so salty. Mm. Mm. 
This is... That's not that good. <laughs> um, it tastes like really old, like soda. Like what? 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 You said you was soda. There's soda in there, right? It was um, cherry cola and, and, and Hawaiian punch or something. Yeah, that's not a good mix, personally. Um, it tastes watery. We'll try to dig into this right here. What did you say? This was garnished with just mac and cheese. Just mac and cheese. Mm. Yeah, with tater tot garnish. I know you chopped it up. I like. I like that. Okay. That's pretty delicious. We got the cornbread, got the onion ring, taste onion ring, definitely. Uh huh? Uh huh. I would honestly eat that whole thing. Over a while of time. Um, was this, is this carnage or is this edible? Edible. <laughs> oh, it's edible? Yeah, you know, gotta get those veggies mm -hmm. in. It's a great grating. <laughs> <laughs> We gotta try an eyeball real quick. <laughs> How's the eyeball taste? A lot for one bite. <laughs> it's kind of like soupy, but it's not as good as the rest of the meal, honestly. Maybe if I would have ate it separately. Oh. <laughs> I really. <laughs> <laughs> you said there was a whole chocolate bar in here, right? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, I can dip that real quick in there. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard as shit, just how biscotti should be. I really like biscotti. <laughs> We're gonna sip of this. Mmm. Mm. That's some quality. Definitely tell there's a whole chocolate bar in there. Mmm. <laughs> That's good. Alright. That's pretty good. Bring the next meal on. I'm gonna call this the uh, leftover sandwich. Okay. And you got a side of rum punch there. So the bread is made out of tater tots, potato pancakes, eggs, flour, and. Um, Onion rings. And okay. the patty itself is hamburger pie, hot dogs, and just just hamburger as well. Okay. Fried it all up, put some cheese, some macaroni on there. Gave you a little bit of raspberry dressing. I like that. Um, with your name. Uh, nothing too fancy about that, but I thought it might a little bit of sweet <laughs> might complement to all that salty. I don't know how I could buy that sauce. <laughs> yeah, well, don't put it on there. That's really it's just for decoration, really. So. And the drink's the sweet, really. So that just okay. go go ahead, dig okay. in. I'm gonna pretend like I didn't see this like be made. Pretend like <laughs> I didn't watch this concoction happen. All right, it's a uh, pretty firm. It's... I'm gonna look for the best bite over here, right here. Yep. <laughs> How's it taste? <laughs> Just there's a lot of flavors going on here, right? <laughs> um, hold on. Need some punch to wash it down. And yeah, we'll just try some punch real quick. Just rum punch, it's pretty basic. Okay. That's pretty gross. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, this, this meat patty thing you got going on here. There's so many flavors going on. And then there's this very strong hot dog, though. At the same time. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> maybe next time, go a little light on the hot dog. Maybe better patties. The cheese somehow, like, took away from it. I don't know how. <laughs> but the cheese took away from the sandwich. Once there was too much cheese, and there's just, like, another overpowering substance in this loaf. What? So you're gonna need a minute to uh, think about your decision. I'm gonna have to think about my decision because um, on both on both ends, they're both well done, very well done. This honestly wasn't that bad. Then again, <laughs> um, just on on pure taste, I'm gonna have to give it to Liv because hers was definitely better. But on um, creativity, I'm also gonna give it to Liv. <laughs> 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 she had multiple things going on. She had it nice, 
presentation. The whole smiley face idea, really great. Yeah, the grape and peanut thing, I really like it. I think I'm gonna start doing that more, personally. <laughs> <laughs> so we win. What are we doing? So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you lips the winner on this song. Um, Woo! Um, both players went really above and beyond on this challenge. I did not expect this. But um lips was edible, so <laughs> 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 So we're gonna give it to lips today. Well next time, you know, I can't win them all. Can't win them all. Like I said, I won 50%. So I'm not even that mad, you know, I'm not even that mad and upset or anything. Okay, I'm next time I'll get out there. I'll keep cooking. You know, I'm not gonna quit or anything. But uh, it would have been really nice to uh, to have won that imaginary ten million dollars that I had left over. You well, know, it's fine. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care. I'm going home. That's right. Got the fifteen million dollars. This kid, he was all like, "Ooh, I'm so good. I cook all the time." But can you believe I won? I really can't believe I actually won. So tell us what you're gonna do with your fifteen million dollars. I'm gonna buy. Oh, a lot of shoes. You're gonna buy shoes? Shoes. Socks or just shoes? Just shoes. And a pony. You heard of your post? First? We're gonna have a pony and a ton of shoes. See you on the street, boys. Click the link at the top to see the next video. Click the link at the bottom to see the previous video. And click the link in the middle to see my last vlog. Also, click the circular channel icon to subscribe for more content.